Um, it says, I have a condo in the Dominican Republic and my main woman lives there with her two children. I am 60, very fit and wealthy. I have a rotation of super hot women in other uh, South American countries. I am, my male friends are completely done with USA women, forever done this pick with her. Hell no. Sloan, are you, excuse me if this is rude, but y'all know you little bit sisters off the chain and I don't have no filter and I don't know how to be politically correct out of damn time. Sloan, are you white? Y'all even running off the white men? Oh, I know you motherfucking lie. Sloan? Sloan, if you're still here, put a one in the motherfucking chat, sir. If you are a brat. And again, your little big sister don't mean no harm. Okay, I'm just off the chain. Okay. The, I know y'all y'all running off. Not white zaddy. Y'all running him off too. The fuck? It's over. Bitch, it's over. It's over. Y'all laughing on dead ass motherfucking serious. Sloan? Are you still at home, Sloan? Put a one in the chat, Sloan. I know y'all motherfucking lie. Oh, oh my God. Not Brad and Chad too. Oh, hell to the naw. Oh, I, bitch, it's done. It's it's done. It's over. It's over. Sloan? Oh, hell no. Sloan, are you still at home? I know you motherfucking lying. I said, I know. Y'all running off Brad and Chad too. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. It's a motherfucking wrap. Is that you in the pick? Sloan said another one. Hold on. Another one. Hold on. Sloan, is, that ain't you in that picture. You ain't 60. He says, yes, I'm white, but I love your channel and I watch it frequently. You keep it Grizzle, gangsta Grizzle. Oh, hell no. Nah. Y'all got so. And again, we're all inclusive over here on the Nick and Marie Dope discussion, you know, but y'all already know we got to represent for our people first, okay? Ain't no shade to none of y'all. Everybody welcome. You know what I'm saying? But damn, it's done. Done, da, done, done, done. It's done. Y'all running off rich. And again, Sloan, I'm just silly. You know it. You know your little bitch is silly, right? Y'all running off white zaddy. Oh, oh, bitch. Who can you run to when you need love? Bitch, who y'all gonna run to? To fill this in this place. Da, da, da. Who y'all gonna run to, bitch? Bitch, it's a rap. It's a rap. Tortilla, bitch. It's a rap. I know y'all motherfucking lying. Rich white zaddy gone too, bitch. I don't know what to I don't know what to say. I don't know what. Now, I believe that there's still some hope. Okay, I do. But this is looking real grim, bitch. This is looking really grim. There's still some men right here in America that's like, look, y'all. I'm ready to give y'all a chance. And so I, I, I will keep trying to fucking help for as long as I can, but we running out of time. The men, all of the motherfucking men is done. They like, 
Lord have mercy. I knew what we I knew we would get here one day. I knew this shit was gonna happen. That's why I've been going so hard. Why do you care, Danica? You got your man. Why you worry about us real women? Don't worry about us. Okay, bitch. There goes your generational wealth. Another one. There goes your man to lead and protect and guide you and provide for you. Another one. Y'all gonna have to take that. Take that. Diddy voice, bitch. I don't know. Maybe y'all listen to your little bit sister now. Maybe. Who knows? I don't. Uh, I don't know the music. You know the real women's. They've been mad at me for years. Since 2015, bitch. They've been mad at me for years. Now y'all, y'all gonna see. Y'all gonna see what I've been trying to do. Lord have mercy. Mona, this is not funny, sis. This is a problem. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna say this. I'm glad I got my man while I still could. Is Thank you, D-Mac. I worked overseas. I told some friends years ago, if brothers start going overseas, it's a wrap. I took several high-earning brothers overseas, and now they're married, girl. I don't know what to tell you, sis. Y'all thought men were just going to tolerate this shit forever, girl. These bitches don't want to listen. They don't want to listen. We the enemy. We the ops, heroes. We the ops. Oh, these pick me, mammy bitches. Who's the pick me, mammy bitch? No. I'll tell you. Braziliana. She the pick me, mammy bitch. Now. Braziliana. She's the pick me, mammy bitch. Boom. That's right. Free as fuck. They getting flew. The men saying, I ain't, I ain't fluing no bitch out. I'm going to flew myself out, bitch. I'm going all overseas. I ain't coming back. Never coming back. Never coming back. No, you can't make me sizzle on some scissor shit. Y'all know that damn song. Maybe you don't, but they on, they on some scissor shit. The music, I just cannot. Look, King me. Braziliana, she got your man, sis. Why you gonna try to listen to me? You gonna try to listen to me now, Braziliana? She got your man, sis. Now she to pick me, dumbass, dumbass. There goes the wealth. I just gonna give me a brat. Did you see Sloan, bitch? Did you see Sloan? Sloan ain't got no home for you either. Lord have mercy. They don't know what they doing, y'all. They don't know what they doing. Thank you to you, our baby. Lord have mercy. Thank you to L Factor. Lord have mercy. One love. Shout out to Sloan. Shout out to Sloan, man. He just opened up a whole new can of worms for me. Like I said, it's a wrap. Tortilla style, bitch. I, I was, look, I already knew what was up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let, let me put it like this, okay? Let me let me let me calm down. Let me calm you. The St. Louis is coming out. Okay. Oh, sportsman, it's not even funny. I guess you better call Tyrone. Call him. But you can't call up slow. Lord have mercy at all. Let me. I already was aware of the fact that so many of us right here, especially my sisters right here, um, we were not trying to do what was necessary as far as competing for the men that we were supposedly fleeing to, right? So, you know, for so long, the rebuttal would be, well, um, I'm just gonna go over to Brad anyway. So we really don't really care about black men, you know, exploring different options or going elsewhere because after all, we don't want them anyway. We've come to realize that it's a better man. And guess what? He's not black. So we're divesting. 
Okay. This is what we've been saying. Now, again, I knew that shit was all cap. Um, excuse me. The St. Louis is coming out. I knew that those statements were false and extremely inaccurate. I was aware of this. I'm looking around and I'm observing the fact that so many of my sisters that have these sentiments don't look up to par, right? Their behavior is not up to par. Everything about them is subpar, if you will. And so I already knew that this was a very delusional conclusion and statement to make, right? When we're out here saying, oh, we don't care, we're divesting and we're going somewhere else. It was like, bitch, where are you going? Because, bitch, don't you know the competition over there is going to be more steep because, bitch. Okay. So I knew that was cap. I mean, I knew that was a lie. But then to have solid evidence right here in motherfucking back to back $100 super chats with the very men that y'all are saying y'all are divesting to saying, Mitch, how they going to divest to me and come over to me when I'm divesting for, they, for me asses. So Danica, calm down. We have been served. Y'all want to know what else is funny that um, Sloan has proven? And I'm going to pop my shit a little bit. The very men that a lot of you sisters out there that hate my motherfucking guts. Excuse me. It's St. Louis coming out. The very black females that do not like me, that have the most negative commentary about me it's mighty funny how the very men that you guys are saying you are divesting to and you know whatever the case it's very funny that those same men are over here bitch oh shit look the irony hold on hold on brad are you over here in crown head nation Brad, are you a crown head? Hold on. Not you over here with the pick me, mammy, bitch. Hold on. Brad. How are they over here with me, bitch? How, how? Hold on, Sway. That's funny as fuck, Bree Bree. That's funny. Y'all laughing. I'm dead ass serious. That's funny. Y'all are trying to tell women not to listen to me, not to rock with me, not to believe what I'm saying, not to do what I'm doing. And the very men that y'all are trying to divest to are over here with me. You know, they're over here in complete solidarity with me. Whoopsie. I, Sloan said, I like your channel. And I'm a white guy. And I'm wealthy. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Not the ghetto tattoo titty bitch. I, but but y'all know what? I've noticed that the truth is universal, amen. So it doesn't care about your vernacular it doesn't care about the city that you're from or the state the truth is not it's the truth right and when you hear it you feel it when you hear it you know it you respect it 
You want to flock to it. And so, ladies, again, I can, <laughs> Danica, don't say that. No, nah, I ain't going to say that. All I'm going to say is this. Y'all can learn something from your little big sister. I obviously am not saying anything that's wrong because the very men that y'all trying to flee to are over here with your little big sis. So, I mean, it's just a lot being exposed. Like, y'all, again, we've been served, okay? And I, and I say we because, again, I'm a black woman. Even though, you know, I got my man, sweetie. So pump, pump, pump it up. Pump it up for me. But I mean, as your sister, I'm going to include myself, right? We got served, bitch. We got exposed. Black men can now know firsthand that y'all bluffing. Now, they already knew that. Again, we already knew y'all was all cap. But now we, we have evidence that y'all not going nowhere. Y'all can't go nowhere. You're not going to prosper until you do right by your nature, which is to be in alignment with that of a masculine man. There are roles. There are rules. There are regulations. You have to follow a certain structure, amen. You cannot escape that. Again, it's universal. And then right here at home, like we run out of all the options. The men right here at home, black and white and other, they like, we don't want them either, Midge. We don't, we don't want that either. We <laughs> And Sloan, no disrespect to, look, if you white, yeah, I know we off the chain. You over here, okay? So don't get in your feelings. Brad is like, hold on. We don't tolerate that shit either. Are they really under the impression that they're going to come over here and get that same shit off with us? Huh. By golly, no. Look, they, they're going over the fuck seas too. They're like, we don't, we, we're not dealing with these bitches either. I'm sorry, Laquisha. Did you think that I was going to allow you not to submit to me? Is that why you've betrayed Demetrius? Because you thought that I would Oh, no, I still expect my woman to cook and clean and never smell like onion rings. <laughs> yeah. I'm just sitting here sipping my organic grain smoothie like, bitch, I know you motherfucking lying. We've been exposed. We ain't got nowhere to, we ain't got nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. Man. Even Sloan said, bitch, I ain't over there either. Fuck she thought. Fuck she thought. Sloan said, bitch, where? <laughs> Lord have mercy. Y'all hella. Look, I'm from St. Louis, okay? When you look stupid, right? We say that you're drove, right? Bitch, you're drove. We are drove as fuck. We look stupid as fuck. You're drove. Like, I'm going over there with Sloan. Sloan said... Bitch, I'm not even over there. What you what you mean? I'm over here with my beautiful black chocolate sister, and she not in America, not in the USA. Mm -mm -mm. This nation says, "Why is Daddy gone too?" Oop! There goes the investment initiative. Oop. Anyways, next stop. Ecuador. No more of these real women's. Love you, Danica. Lord have mercy. Yeah, I didn't want to listen to your little bitch sister. I hate that bitch. She a pick me. She's never identified. She over there pandering to these ninjas. She ain't shit. She hate women. And then the men that y'all want over here with me. Ain't that some shit? In agreement with me. Ain't that some shit? Ain't, ooh, all of them are saying the same thing. They're never coming back. If we don't act right, ladies, it's a it's a wrap. Again, I got my husband. 
I know what to do. I'm doing it. I'm trying to tell you. Yeah, yeah I don't want to listen to me. And again, the same men that y'all saying that y'all want, they over here with me co-signing what I'm saying and while you're going against it. So what is that? What is that telling to you? You got Sloan over here dropping two hundred dollars in my in my super chats, talking about yeah, I rock with you. What you're saying is facts. I'm done with those females too, cause they don't act right, and they're not trying to practice what you're saying. Y'all got served today. Y'all got so like motherfucker today. So much was exposed today. So much was exposed today. It's pathetic. Y'all don't have the options like y'all said that y'all do. Because those men are doing the same thing that these black men are doing. And black men that want families and stuff like that, they're done. They're going elsewhere. We we y'all got served today. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna stop saying we. That's y'all. This this y'all. Again, I got what I need. Thank you, Exiled again. Black women traveling overseas. Will have a much different experience. You think the world doesn't have internet? World star? You think they haven't seen the depravity? Mm? Let's go here, exile. Do y'all think these other groups of men don't see how we disrespect our men? You think that they want a part of that? It's like, again, they're looking at us like we don't want that either. And a lot of us don't even understand how disrespectful. Let's say it is. A lot of us don't understand how disrespectful we can be coming off to these other groups of men. To where we're like, oh, fuck y'all black men. Go overseas. Do what you want to do. You know, we don't want y'all anyway. We just going to come over to, to Brad and Chad and uh, feed them shit. And they're going to love it. And, and they're going to tolerate it. And they're going to accept it. And it's like, how disrespectful is that? So the only reason why you're over here is not because you genuinely are looking for a connection or love or you just have respect and all of that. You're over here because you feel like we would be more receptive to bullshit? That's disrespectful. And we're so damn dumb, we don't even understand that that's what we're saying in so many words. Let's give another corny ass example. When we're saying that, it's like, <clears throat> oh, y'all want us to uh, be respectful of y'all house and clean up and cook. And not track our dirty uh, shoes on your floor in your kitchen and shit. That's okay. Because I'm just going to go to Brad house. And I'm not going to cook for him. And I'm going a, I'm to a get his house dirty. And I'm going to track mud all in his damn kitchen. Because, you know, he accepted. that. That's disrespectful as hell. Like, bitch, I, ain't, I don't want that over my house either. Y'all just, y'all just, y'all don't even know how stupid and inconsiderate y'all be sounding. No, like, come on, y'all. This is why these men, all men are like, I'm done. Y'all don't know what y'all doing. Y'all don't even understand the help when it's presented to you. Y'all call it pick me advice. And y'all don't understand that this is how you're going to get picked by any man. This shit is universal. You can't ditch it. Not for the type of men that y'all are looking for. The well-to-do wealthy guys, you think they don't require submission, respect, cooperation, love, support, understanding, nurturing, sex? Women that are in shape and attractive? Please. Please. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Again, a lot was exposed today, y'all. Uh, 